Good morning, class three. Welcome to your maths class. How are you, students? I hope you all are fine and doing your work regularly. Friends, today we are going to revise your previous worksheets. Okay. In this worksheet, I have only given you the revision work. The first question here I am giving you is write the number name. Okay. You all of you know how to write the number name. Does number given first in the ten ones, tens, hundreds, and thousand place? Okay. So the number name will be two thousand three hundred. Hundred fifty-six. Okay. Similarly, next is nine seven eight four. You have to write ones, tens, hundreds, and thousand places. It will help you to indicate the digits properly. Okay. In the same, write the number name. That is nine thousand. Seven hundred eighty-four. Okay. Next is write the predecessor and the successor of the given number. I have given you a number two thousand five hundred and ninety-one. Predecessor means the number comes before. Okay, and successor means the number that comes after. Don't get confused. It's just like before and after digits. Predecessor two thousand five hundred and ninety one. Just subtract one from the given number. That is two thousand five hundred and ninety. It just comes before this number, and after is two thousand five hundred and ninety two. Means two thousand five hundred ninety, two thousand five hundred ninety one, and two thousand five hundred ninety two. Okay. Similarly, next number is given nine thousand nine hundred ninety one. So what will come before? It will be nine thousand nine hundred ninety eight. Okay. And then what will come after? Just add one. The number will be zero 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 one. Okay, isn't it easy? So do all the sums. Next is write in expanded form. You have to expand the number means open the numbers. Okay, as you have read here, ones, tens, hundred, and thousand. Similarly, just write here also ones, tens, hundred, and thousand means two thousand. I have written here. Two thousand plus three in the hundred place. That means three hundred seven in the tens place. Means seven multiplied by ten. That is seventy plus nine in the ones place. Nine ones are nine. This is known as expanded form. And then you have to write the number name also. Okay. Two thousand three hundred seventy nine. In expanded form, given question, you have to do your sums like this. First, expand the number, and then write the number name. You will never get confused about the numbers after doing like this, okay? And the last question, and but very important, expand and add. First, you have to expand the number, and then you have to add the numbers, okay? I have given you numbers only up to hundred place. How will you expand this number? Three hundred. Seventy plus four. This is the expanded form. Similarly, expand this number. Two hundred plus ten plus five. Put the numbers in the brackets. Okay. Now add the numbers in the hundred place. 
300 plus 200 put it in a bracket plus next in the tens place 70 plus 10 again put this number in a bracket okay next in the ones place this number 4 plus 5 again put this number in a bracket okay now add this number in the rough 300 plus 200 that is equals to 500 okay you got the answer put this plus sign here 70 plus 10 that is 80 remove the brackets and write the answer here put this plus sign here 4 plus 5 9 okay got it now add all the numbers in the rough 589 add them that is 9 8 5 okay the answer is 589. This is your required answer. You got it, friends? Practice this question. Expand and add very carefully. Okay? That's all for today. Have a nice day. Bye.